Hey there, welcome back to another exciting video. Today, we're diving deep into engine code P0006, which is fuel shutoff valve control circuit low. By the end of this video, you'll learn about the symptoms of a P0006 trouble code, its causes, necessary steps to troubleshoot, and preventive measures to avoid P0006 code. So what exactly does the engine code P0006 mean? Well, it indicates issues with the fuel shutoff valve control circuit. Specifically, it indicates that the circuit's voltage is lower than the expected range. Let's dive into the symptoms of a sneaky little trouble code, P0006. It can cause some serious headaches under the hood. So let's break it down, one symptom at a time. All right, let's start with number one, check engine light illuminated. The check engine light illuminates when there is an issue with the engine management system. A persistent P0006 code may trigger the check engine light to turn on, indicating a problem with the fuel shutoff valve control circuit. Now on to number two, engine performance. Poor engine performance can indeed occur due to the fuel shutoff valve not functioning properly, leading to inadequate fuel supply and affecting the engine's overall performance and efficiency. The number three symptom is engine stalling. Intermittent engine stalling can be a symptom of the P0006 code, as the fuel shutoff valve's malfunction can disrupt the engine's fuel supply, causing it to stall unexpectedly. In number four, we're talking about no start condition. The P0006 code can lead to a situation where the vehicle fails to start because the fuel shutoff valve remains closed, preventing fuel from reaching the engine. So, what causes the engine code P0006? When your car throws a P0006, it says the fuel shutoff valve circuit's voltage is low, which means the voltage is lower than the expected range. Now, a few things could be causing this. We're talking electrical problems, faulty fuel shutoff valve or fuel shutoff valve relay. Let's break it down one by one. First up, we've got electrical wire issues, an open circuit in the fuel shutoff valve control circuit can lead to the P0006 trouble code. This may occur due to damaged or frayed wires, corroded connectors, or poor electrical connections. Number two, faulty fuel shutoff valve. A failed fuel shutoff valve, whether due to mechanical or electrical issues, can trigger the P0006 trouble code. This valve is crucial for controlling the flow of fuel to the engine, and any malfunction can disrupt the fuel supply, leading to various issues. Check out the video in the corner for guidance to diagnose a faulty fuel shutoff valve. And coming in at number three, faulty powertrain control module. The PCM is responsible for controlling various engine functions, including the operation of the fuel shutoff valve. If the PCM malfunctions or fails, it may not send the proper signals to the fuel shutoff valve, resulting in irregularities in its operation and triggering the P0006 code. Check out the video in the corner for guidance to diagnose a faulty powertrain control module. At number four, failed fuel shutoff valve relay. A faulty relay can render the fuel shutoff valve inoperative, triggering the P0006 code. You can test the relay. For detailed instructions, refer to our blog on how to test a relay. Check the detailed article in the description. The P0006 code may be accompanied by various other OBD2 codes. It is important to find the root cause of P0006 to diagnose effectively. Reading other codes that come with the P0006 code may help in finding the root cause. The list of related codes is long, therefore we have provided this information in the description with their meanings. Check in the description for more details. Now how to diagnose and fix the P0006 code. When it comes to diagnosing and fixing the P0006 code, it's all about pinpointing issues with the fuel shutoff valve control circuit. Diagnosing the P0006 code typically requires specialized diagnostic tools and equipment. However, there are some methods you can try yourself to diagnose and potentially fix the issue. The first method is looking for any additional diagnostic trouble codes that may be present. These could provide clues about related issues contributing to the P0006 code. To fix this, address any other codes that are present, as resolving these may also resolve the P0006 code. Method two is check for electrical wire issues. Inspect the electrical wiring related to the fuel shutoff valve for any signs of damage, such as frayed wires, loose connections, or corroded terminals. Check fuses and relays related to the fuel shutoff valve circuit. Method three is inspect the fuel shutoff valve, visually inspect the fuel regulator, 
and its associated components for any signs of damage, such as corrosion, leaks, or physical wear. If any physical damage or leaks are found, replace the fuel shutoff valve. Finally, to prevent the occurrence of the P0006 code, it's important to implement routine maintenance and take proper care. Here are some preventative measures. Ensure that the fuel filter is replaced at the manufacturer recommended intervals to prevent clogs and restrictions in the fuel system. Use reputable fuel sources and avoid contaminated or low quality fuel that could potentially damage the fuel system components. Periodically inspect the fuel lines, connections and components for signs of wear, leaks or damage. Clean any debris or buildup that may accumulate in the fuel system. Ensure the fuse box and associated electrical components are inspected and maintained regularly. Clean any corrosion or buildup that may affect electrical connections and functionality. If you found this video informative and helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with fellow automotive enthusiasts, and subscribe for more content on automotive diagnostics and repair. Your support helps us create more valuable content like this. Thank you for watching.